girl? Did you come over for a treat? Yes, I know. The ponies are there. They're making noise. So I Saturday is the day I plan to go and get her some magnesium after it gets on her system. By Monday, I plan to release her. Release you. It'll be a week that she will have been separated from the ponies side by side. But it's time. It will be time to integrate the herd, you guys. You want another treat? Do you want another treat? Tell me yes. Do you want another treat? <gasps> this horse, I'm telling you, such a different experience. I swear she's been training a lot of things. Like when I walk into her stall, she backs up, shies away from the door. As soon as I put down her food, she comes forward. I don't want to try and change any of that because it's good, it's good stuff. Like she's trained. The only part that's hard about her is that she's anxious and nervous. And I try to eliminate all the reasons why I thought she was anxious and nervous before I really started to ride her. So I took care of her belly, I took care of the bit, which I thought were making her anxious. I don't know about my saddle, it seems to fit her okay. I watched videos of me riding in her old saddle, it seemed to be the same kind of a fit. You can't tell from watching a video, obviously. So, today's the day, I am gonna ride her for real. I'm gonna take her out, walk her around that arena, and I'm gonna take her for a spin, and I'm gonna work with her. The problem is, I don't know how to work with her. Like, so, I've been watching a lot of videos on gated horses, and I know that she needs to relax, Slow down and drop her head. That's all I know. So, yeah, I need to get her there. I do have some support, but it's like we're falling. Molly! Molly! Stop! Thank you. What a good puppy. Anyways, I do have support, but we're falling into a bad season and it's gonna be rough. Like, I want to ride her though. I'm going to be riding her this whole winter. I'm mostly going to be building a relationship in preparation for spring, but I'm going to be riding her too so she doesn't get out of the habit of that. Just working slow, working slow, doing whatever I can. So wish me luck. Today's the day. I'm going to ride this girl outside and I am going to love it. Thank you. Thank you for being such a good puppy. Sit. Good girl. Paw. Good girl. Other paw? Nope. Other one? She's like, I don't know what you mean. There you are. Where were you? That is not good. Apparently, this dog ran off. That's not good. That is not good, you little girl. Anyway, welcome to today's video. I'm so excited to have you guys here along with me while on this journey while I ride my horse. I'm excited. But we have other things we have to do today first, so let's go do them. All right, so before we even get started with homeschool today and what we have to do, I want you and Gabby to take some little bags outside on the grass, some little baggies, and why pick up all the dog poop. Then you have to do finish the living room. I'll finish cleaning the living room, but you go ahead. I want you guys to pick up the dog poop. Three, <laughs> three a dog's poop is a lot of poop. Yes, this girl is such a princess. Dalmatians are a million dollar puppy meaning that they're amazing and that they cost a million dollars to raise because the food is really expensive and then but she does good on that food. yeah she's just good though she's once we got the food all figured out she's been doing great such a princess we're waiting for princess number two she's curling her hair Ooh. so the girls literally dressed identical today not on purpose it just was a fluke it just happened happens like that all the time so uh, one of the things that we have to get done like today's thursday and uh, tomorrow's friday and then the next day is show day we have a show coming up in three days so we have a lot of things to do unfortunately for us it's on halloween so that means they're doing a halloween costume show so we're trying to figure out what we're going to dress our horses up as this is not something that i excel at i hate wasting money on costumes because you only use it for one day and then it's done and i'm not good at being creative like that i just cannot figure it out at all so they're looking it up on the tv all these costume ideas we have an idea gabby has an idea what storm's gonna be right you know what storm's gonna be mm -hmm. we have an idea what finney's gonna be right do i have to ride in dress i don't know we have to figure it out so we so chino and finn are i don't know do you want to dress up both horses because you're going to do like a, ch a costume change or do you just want to dress up one horse we'll dress up both all right and over here, the dogs are playing Sit, over, wrestling. But... Yeah, yeah. All right, let's do that. All right, so we know exactly what we're going to be. Go get a piece of paper. It's oh going to stab you in the back. Gabby is not excited about that saddle. You guys can't see. Okay, 
So you guys go get a piece of paper and let's write down what we're going to be and all the things we need to buy. And then let's go to the store and get what we need to make today? this. Yeah, right now. Because uh, I'm going to. work on it today and tomorrow? Yeah, we need as much time as possible to work okay. on it. So we're going to get a black. Today is arts and craft day. Seriously, you guys can't chill for five minutes while we, while we figure out what's happening here. All right, so we are headed to Walmart to try and we got some good costumes. Hopefully they turn out nice. Because being the one with the worst costume is never fun. And that's always the problem with me. Like Sam is so good at this stuff. So good. But he never has time to help us because he's always at work. So, all right, are you ready? Are you excited about your costumes? Yes. Yeah. Gabby's kind of like me. She doesn't really love it. But Sylvie, you love it, right? Yeah. There's gonna be a No, we're not telling them. Don't tell them. It's gonna be a surprise. I wanna like see if you guys can guess who they are, but it's gonna be like a full day of figuring out all the costumes. Why is my car moving? Sophia moved it. Oh, okay. Well ponies are all good, having lunch. We're gonna go and head out right now and we'll see you at Walmart. Gabby's ruining the place. Oh look at that uh, what is that? Werewolf. Were bad werewolf. That's not good for us. Alright, so let the shopping begin. Where did you find a back black cape? And does it have a hood? Long, though. Yeah, it has a hood. Oh, that's long. perfect. Yeah, that's okay. I think that's $50. Oh, 50% off. Seven. Oh, that's my kind of cape. All right, throw it in. Yeah. Finn should be Spider-Man. No, Finn should be a cutie. Finn could be Spider-Man, but Finn I... Finn should be... Who fits this? What? Now we've lost body. Is that yeah, who would fit that? <laughs> Little Miss Kiwi is skinny. Oh, there's a bigger one. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> All right, so the girls have their list of what they need to get. Gabby has to get a cape. All right, so you guys go. Are you? Are you? Now I know who fits this one. Girls that are built like that, like girls sticks. Yeah. I don't know. I kind of like sticks. But anyways. All right, you guys. Are you guys gonna go off? You know that's a chocolate sound if you ever heard one. Oh, more costumes. That's not, uh, wait, what do we need a sword for? Oh yeah, okay, we need a sword. Oh my gosh, that is perfect. I know. Yeah, and we can edit, we can, we can alter it, Gabby. We can alter it. Gabby loves Annabelle. This kind of suits Gabby, I think. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. We're getting that one. Way too early. And that one. I can't believe it's almost Christmas. Like, it's shocking. All right, so I have this polyester stuffing. And I'm thinking I'm going to get both bags. There's only two bags left. But it looks like this. I don't know if this is going to be, like, too much or not enough. So I'm going to get them both. All right, so we got everything that we needed except for Gabby needs one thing and then Sophie needs one thing. So we're going to go out with Sam tonight. Because it's we, where we have to go shopping is like a place that is hard for me to drive. I only drive in, in places that I know. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna head home, have quick lunch. Now I'm gonna ride my horse. I'm gonna I have to get my costume. My horse, yeah. And then we're gonna get everything, bring it up to the house that we need because we still need stuff from our barn. And then we're gonna get ready. We're gonna spend the rest of this night getting ready and watching a movie. Watch a movie. That's what we like to do if we craft. We need to craft more often. But anyway, yeah. So let's go. Ride my horse. It's gotten to a point now where I love being alone in the barn. I love doing all the work. It's gotten to the point that I prefer to be in the barn by myself because, hi. Hi, Princess Penny. I just was in here a few seconds ago and asked her if she wanted to come, but she was napping. So she didn't come. But then when I left, she was like, you left me. Oh, don't be jerky. Don't be, don't be, oh, I just wanted to clean your eye. Don't be like that. Be nice. You know that I take good care of your eyes. She's got tea on her eye. Anyway, today is the time we're going to go outside and ride. You want to go for a ride, pretty, pretty penny? You want to go for a ride? So for safety reasons, I want somebody here with me when I ride, especially like now at the beginning. But soon, I'm going to come down. Like, I want to ride her every day. And it's not because I want to ride her and because it's fun. I want to ride her so that I can get used to her and so I can learn her and so we can learn each other and so that in the spring I can jump on and 
Really, Ryan, she's watching me. Hi, pretty penny. Hello. I'm getting my boots on and we're gonna go for a ride. She's like, oh no, not that. I was gonna put my, my riding boots on and then come and get her. Then I realized my riding boots were freezing cold. Then I was like, mm, I'll tack you up first and then we'll go for a ride. Are you actually running from me? Are you gonna run? She's, she, I might not, I shouldn't maybe, I should maybe. All right, let's go. You ready to go? She's a little spicy, you guys. I swear I can read your guys' minds. You're gonna be telling me in the comments, it's time to set Penny free, let her be with your friends. And I agree, like it's causing more problems I feel like now than is preventing. But I have to give her some magnesium first just because I saw her with her other horse friends and these guys are just little tiny ponies and I have to, like I'm never putting my ponies in a bad situation again. And I know that she kind of is a fighter a little. The texture is like a totally different way. Anyways, I'm gonna go get it. Maybe I'll get it tomorrow or by the weekend for sure. So her owner told me that she likes her, her mane brushed and it's true. When I brush her mane, she just stands there and puts her head all the way down to the ground and lets me brush it. She loves it. Never seen a horse that loved that before. I'm sure there are lots though. Oh, I got tea on your eye. That's not cool. Okay, so I got her mostly tacked up. I mean, look at how huge she is. She looks huge. Like, she looks so much taller than Storm and Stella. I put this up. There's like lots of, oh yeah, there's lots of clearance there. When I sit down, obviously it'll be a little tighter. So I'm gonna show you guys what she does when I tighten the girth. So she's been mostly okay, but as soon as I like set the saddle down on her, she pinned her ears and started snapping before she would do it as soon as she saw the saddle. Like she's getting better. But watch her. Okay, so I'm barely going to do anything with this. That's not going to be tight, but I'll let you see if she'll do anything. That's a girl. Nope, she's looking for a treat. <laughs> the ponies are acting wild. And the cats are acting wild. So she didn't actually do anything when I just tightened the girth a little bit. It's because I've been slowly doing treats with her. Same with her bit. Her owner always gives her a treat with the bit. Has always done it and she gobbles the bit like a little piggy. So anyway, I am a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. Cause I'm gonna be riding outside and I feel like I saw some signs. <laughs> I don't know you guys, like. I do feel a little nervous and I'm riding outside. Oh no, she's gonna poop. Don't poop inside, that's the rule. The rule at this house is to not poop inside. You didn't get the memo, so I won't get mad this time, okay? Um, so, yeah, like, not only are we running outside, it's really windy, really cool, really brisk, really crazy, and the ponies are gonna be doing laps because they're already freaking out that she left them, even though they all hate each other, so it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be scary, but I'm gonna do it anyway because I wanna show Sophia that even when you're scared, you have to try. Okay, so this is my bitless bridle. Are you in the indoor? Should I ride in the indoor first? Yeah. Yeah, no, she might really be windy. psycho outside. It's windy. The ponies were bolting. Yeah, but she's like a seasoned. I know the ponies are bolting because they took away their friend to me. Their friend to me. No, like they're. It's. I know. So you think I should ride inside? I really want to ride outside so bad. It's really cold. I know, but I still want to do it. And it's windy and. You might die if you ride it. Oh, okay, so. So I don't have my boots or my helmet. Try this. That one we might be too that. tight. Oh, okay, was it too loose? So this is our my this is our bitless bridle. Fiona will only let us wear. Fiona will only let us wear side pulls because some other bitless bridles and hackamores horses can have really bad reactions if you pull wrong, and she's seen just really bad things happen. So a side pull is the softest that we could find. And so this is what we ride in. She's really spooky today. If I get on her first, can I use your helmet? You're fine. I'll she is fine. What? I want you yeah, to yeah, you're not getting on her first. I'm getting on her first. But look at you, you've been looking thinner. I need so they be eating and eating and eating and she still looks thinner. Look, turn around, let me see your bum. Okay, that's kind of rude, huh? But her pants are like super baggy, I noticed them. These ones were always like that. See? She's good though. Like, she, she doesn't care. But she cares. 
All right, good girl. Do you think this is like the right spot on her nose? Yeah. Okay. She doesn't like being grabbed and held with the rings, like mom does. I know. I know. So one of the things I need to work on is me. And you don't need to squeeze her. She's not a horse that you need to squeeze. I feel like she's better today with you than last time. Good. That's what I wanted. Some transitions. Good girl. Can you? I want to see her back up. She doesn't know what you want. No. There we go. Good girl. Gabby will be, like, uh -oh, Gabby be looking like Darth Vader walking up to my spooky horse. Typically, she's not spooky. It's just that she's new to this place. It's a crazy and day. Windy and, windy, fresh, and the ponies. She hates them. But look at she handles Darth Vader just fine. So one of the things that you can tell that you'll be able to go bitless with your horse is if you can make them drop their head and you can make them back up. So why do you only get to use one rein? Oh. Good girl. So the peanut gallery here is all laughing at your mom. She goes over each this other. is why she's this is why they're laughing. Look how fast she's going. I think you need to ride her with a bit. Oh, it'd be the same with a bit. No, it doesn't seem like you have any control. I'm fine though. Uh, no, no, no. So she goes over a jump or jumps the tires. Yeah. 
Cause you're my sweetheart Penny's gonna have some grass because Penny deserves grass. I know we look rough and I know I don't know what I'm doing. All I'm doing is trying to just walk with her and make her go slow. That's what the whole thing was about. But then a couple times I tried to like gate on the way home because I love it. Like the lady told me that she's not perfect, but anything she does, she never does anything nasty, but anything that she does do, you can just sit. Like you just sit there and tell her no and nothing bad happens. And that's why I wanted a gate gated horse. Because with the gated horse, I mean, I don't know how to explain it, but she's just such an easy sit. I don't ever want to stop. The only reason I'm stopping is because my family wants to go and do other stuff. And I'm nervous to ride by myself. So I'm either going to have to find a friend or learn to ride by myself. I think I'm going to be riding by myself. I want to ride her every day, you guys. Like, I never want to stop. Like, this, this, this is best birthday of my life I was singing to her you are my sunshine and when I sang it to her she definitely got more calm I'm not in love with this this bridal thing I don't like the reins they're hard to hold and I don't like things that are joined like this because it gets caught in her hair and I tried to be like more loose on the reins and let her have more more go I love her the girls were like you're never gonna do it out there she's gonna be alone she's gonna be scared you're gonna die and I made them you guys I was brave and I just did it even though people said I couldn't I still did it like this is our place I hope it doesn't snow for a while because this is where we're gonna ride I'm gonna ride her again so bad you guys the queen herself spent money you spent money hmm? you spent money yeah yeah Gabby's cheap she does not like to spend money she got herself some stuff at the dollar store, look with Sandbot. Three of them, and then another lighter, because our show this weekend is gonna be in the dark. Yep, in the dark. We're gonna have a show in the dark, and that's okay. It's gonna be okay, Sam. Save the day with the lights, with the headlamps. Also, this weekend, Sunday night, is the time change, so finally. I cannot get myself out of bed in the morning unless it's light out. Like, it gets... Light out. It'll still be dark, but like till 7.30. 7.30 it'll start to get light out. Like, I can handle 7.30, but when it doesn't get light till like 8.30, almost 9 o'clock, it's hard. Like, I hate getting out of bed. Back. It'll be dark. What? It'll be dark longer. <laughs> It'll just be... It'll be light in the morning. Light no, in the morning. It'll be lighter at night. Yeah. It's yeah. fall back, so it'll be dark still. Anyways, the time change is happening, but this is our last show in the dark. Don't you know that you're beautiful?